everyone. Can you hear me at the back? Can you hear me? Great, great. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I hope everyone uh, had a nice uh, lunch break and, and a dessert. Uh, so I'm here to talk to you about this topic, which is uh, purpose beyond taste and building iconic brands. And uh, you know, when we were first discussing about this topic, uh, you know, a few things kind of crossed my mind. Firstly, you know, if you look at uh, Mondelez India and the products we have, we have we are in the business of snacking. We have a strong portfolio of chocolates and biscuits. And for us, and I think uh, this is true, should be true for any uh, snacking company or a food company that taste is almost like a table stick. Uh, if you are providing a food experience to someone, then it better be tasty. Otherwise, you know, why would anyone have you? So taste is almost a table stick. It is also something which you have to keep working on to improve it further. And that is what we do uh, through the different renovation programs that we run in our business. And I think it is also important as we think of communication, brand communication, it is also important uh, to make sure that we are able to communicate that visually as well on how dairy milk is the gold standard of chocolate in the country, how is silk a very smooth chocolatey experience, the Oreo that you can twist, lick and dunk, you know, and how Fuse is actually a very different chocolate. Fuse, a five star is something which you can continue to chew on. So it's very important to make sure that you are able to communicate the taste experience in a visually very impactful way. But when it comes to food brands, when it comes to snacking brands, that is not enough. And that has been our learning. And what really helps build a strong emotional connection with people and with consumers is if you are able to lean in on a purpose that is meaningful to people, something which is a slice of life uh, from their daily routine, something which they really care about beyond just the taste experience of your brand. So it's very important that we are able to dig deep into that purpose uh, and then bring that purpose to life in an impactful way. Uh, and brand purpose is, of course, like, you know, a much... Uh, I, I was looking at the agenda for today and I saw, uh, you know, a couple of panel discussions and a talk around brand purpose, so you probably heard a lot about it already. Uh, but from our side, what when we think of brand purpose, for us, two or three things are very important. Firstly, it has to be something which is meaningful to people and something which will help improve their lives. That is very important when it comes to identifying what the purpose of your brand is. The second, and even more importantly, it has to be credible. And if it is not credible, then it will not be seen as something which, is, uh, which the brand is trying to do in an authentic way. Uh, and that will bring down the impact of whatever you are saying or doing. So I think these two pieces are really important. Uh, and when we look at uh, uh, Cadbury, Cadbury Dairy Milk, or look at our gifting brand, which is Celebrations. Our purpose is really about inspiring the world to be more generous. And now let's look at what I just said before on firstly, whether it is important for people. And if you look at India as a society, and I'll just show you through some executions on how actually it is something which people want to be, want to do. You want to be more generous in different situations, different contexts, and I'll just show you a few examples on what we ourselves have done. The second is it is also very credible for Cadbury Dairy Milk to do and say that. If you see, we are the gold standard of chocolate experience in this country. We are seen as synonymous with the chocolate category. Also the stories we have told over the last many, many years have all been about moments of happiness, small moments of happiness, big moments of happiness, and how dairy milk as a mita fits very well in those moments, our tagline around kuch meetha ho jaye is not just the physiological experience of a meetha, but it is also how it sweetens that moment. Whether it is, I'm sure, you know, some of you will remember our communi past communication around kuch meetha ho jaye, papu pass ho gaya, kuch meetha ho jaye, ya pehli tari kuch meetha ho jaye. So all those moments that are associated with happiness and how can the brand seamlessly fit into those moments. So hence, it also passes the credibility test when it comes to having this as our purpose. And now what I want to do is to not give you more theory because I'm sure like you've heard a lot. Uh, so I thought it'd be good to show a few videos uh, to all of you on how uh, Cadbury has brought this purpose to life in different ways and how there has been a, an insight at the heart of each of those executions. So let's go there.
This was, uh, you know, a campaign we did around, I would say, three to four years back. Uh, and this really uh, delves into the whole theme of class difference in India and how there is a class divide. They're privileged and then they're acknowledged and they are unacknowledged, not so privileged. And how can the privileged and the acknowledged be more generous to those who are not? And just a couple of, uh, you know, executions in this space that I would like to show to you. So can we play the first video? Can you pause? We Baba. need the audio. Chintu Baba! Chintu Baba! What happened, Shanta Bhai? What happened? You forget the license, you forget the money, you forget the speaker. And today, you put it without checking? But it doesn't happen. You always check. What does it mean? I didn't forget it, Shanta Bhai. So how did it come out? It was for you. It was for you. It was for you. It was for you. कैडबरी डेरी मिल्क कुछ अच्छा हो जाए कुछ मीठा हो जाए वेला भरा मेला देखा जी के भी अकेला देखा खुद के लिए जीना भी सॉरी सर रोल नंबर सर मैं बेटिया का रोल नंबर है। आप वो थ्री सेवन नहीं। थ्री सेवन। अरे हमें यकीन था सिलेक्शन हो गया है। मेरे नाना तेरे आंसू, तेरी खुशियाँ मैं भी नाचूं। ऐसे ही थोड़ी लाएँ यार। मुबारक हो। अब खड़े क्या हो? जाओ, जाओ। कभी किसी और की खुशी में शामिल होकर देखिए। Cadbury Dairy Milk, कुछ अच्छा हो जाए, कुछ मीठा हो जाए। So you know if you see the the tagline of our communication is कुछ अच्छा हो जाए, and that कुछ अच्छा हो जाए captures the spirit of generosity. If I am generous to you, it just brings, it makes the moment more happy. And you know, I think it, the, what is rooted here, and when we talk to consumers, uh, you know, what they see in it is, oh yes, somebody who is privileged is acknowledging me, and not just acknowledging me. If you see the the, the last film that we showed, it is not just acknowledging; it is actually also participating in your happiness. So you are as happy for me. You know, if something good has, good hap something good has happened to me, the other person is as happy for me. So it's also participating in their happiness. Uh, so this this is the this is one of the spaces uh, you know which we. Uh, kind of uh, executed in the recent past. In fact, that's our the current film that's on air. Uh, if we go to the next, uh, maybe I can. So this one, uh, you know, is uh, around Diwali, and uh, in the last three four years, uh, we have been, uh, you know, at around this theme of how do we make everybody's Diwali happy, and particularly, you know, coming on the back of COVID in 2020. Uh, there was a communication done which was not just a Cadbury ad and it was really trying to help the small retailers, uh, which we followed up in 2021 with another version of not just a Cadbury ad in, in, in which we had Shah Rukh Khan as a celebrity. And he actually made small, small videos for these small retailers. Uh, and this, this campaign actually won a, a can, uh, a Grand Prix actually. And um, uh, that was 2021 trying to help the small retailers. This year, in 2023, our campaign was around, how do we make Diwali of homepreneurs happy? And this is the, our execution from 2022, which was all about, you know, generosity is also about making everybody else's Diwali happy. And there are a lot of these shopkeepers who don't even have a shop, you know, the thelawalas. And how do we make sure, what can we do? What can Cadbury do? And what can people do to make their Diwali more happy, more joyous? So let's look at this one. I think the video can be played from there. Come on, sir. Doctor, sir. Ah, hey, boy. Two days I'm looking for you. Hey, what's up, doctor? Where you got the place, you sat there. How did you remember? Come on, sir. 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 Come on
कुछ लेना था नहीं आ, कुछ देना था आपकी दिवाली भी हैप्पी हो थैंक यू और आपकी दिवाली और भी हैप्पी बैग पर क्यू आर कोड स्कैन करिए बाबा तुम्हारी खुद की दुकान और अपने पास के होकर से कनेक्ट कीजिए तेरी खुशियाँ में भी नाचू दिवाली मुबारक दाम हो जाए इस दिवाली जिनकी दुकान नहीं उनकी भी दुकान खुलेगी कैडबरी सेलिब्रेशन कुछ अच्छा हो जाए कुछ मीठा हो जाए so this this actually obviously we were facilitating it but it also you know made sure that people were finding hawkers near where they live and making sure that they people can find them on this on the website so this was the uh, our executions around uh, diwali the next one is uh, ground staff and you know this is if you see uh, if you look at ipl and you know the team from star sports is here or if you look at any cricket event there's a lot of spotlight on players you know on the managers the coaches and everyone around it but not enough on people who actually make the match happen which is the ground staff uh, and this is again an opportunity for the brand to bring its purpose to life let's see how if you can play the video in a cricket obsessed nation like india cricketers get all the love and attention from everyone but the ground staff who work tirelessly behind the scenes go unacknowledged so this cricketing season let's celebrate the ground staff too introducing cadbury dairy milk proud sponsors of the ground staff a sponsorship that pampers indulges and treats the ground staff just like the stars with cadbury provide the ground staff with something designer something cool something that also makes them feel like superstars from designer uniforms to the best hotels from their nutrition and fitness to their daily commute all taken care of from the start of the cricketing season to the end of it अच्छा लगता है पूरी टीम एक साथ है बहुत गर्व फील हो रहा है कि हम भी देश के लिए कुछ करते हैं दिस क्रिकेटिंग सीजन लेट्स सेलिब्रेट द ग्राउंड स्टाफ टू द अनएक्नॉलेज सुपरस्टार्स एंड वन ऑफ द एक्चुअली इन इम्पैक्ट ऑफ दिस कैंपेन वाज दैट बीसीसीआई एक्चुअली इंक्रीज द सैलरी ऑफ द ग्राउंड स्टाफ इन द नेक्स्ट ईयर इटसेल्फ सो वी आर वेरी हैप्पी फॉर दैट टू हैपन and if you look at the next one i mean this is our campaign from this year which we did around the world cup which was again uh, going back to this the class divided i spoke of that while cricket is a, a great unifier right it brings everyone together uh, but uh, in the end the class difference sometimes does come in between like somebody is able to watch the match a live match somebody is having to work at the same time or even going to the stadium not everybody is able to go to the stadium and watch, watch a match and that was really at the heart of this campaign let's see this and then i'll say a couple of things more about it if you can play the campaign aaj ye do bowler khelenge nahi nahi batting pitch hai aaj to all rounder khelega all rounder nahi khelega sir laga lo laga lo laga lo sir kaka office se do aur log aa rahe hain thoda extra khana banana please sorry sorry phatapat banate hain ruko 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 maine khana bahar se mangwa liya hai kyun kyunki kaka free nahi aaj kaka to free hai ha kyunki kaka aur main aaj मैच देखने जा रहे हैं स्टेडियम में लेकिन हम तो मतलब खेल रहे हैं जिता के आना मजा आएगा रजिस्टर कीजिए और ये वर्ल्ड कप सबके साथ बैठकर देखिए कैडबरी डेयरी मिल्क कुछ अच्छा हो जाए कुछ मीठा हो जाए so it's it's not just uh, you know inspiring people to do it but actually the brand also enabled uh, and people to actually be able to do it by giving free ipl tickets which you could only go to if you go with your staff so that is actually making it happen uh, on the ground as well and a song about slice of life and you know this is a slice of life and piyush pande who you know uh, uh, on ogilvy he actually said this that i have the most lively discussions on cricket with actually my cook and that is the beautiful thing about this game right everybody is knowledgeable but how can you make sure everybody is able to watch it too so that that's the sit together 
and uh, you know the the last one that i'll play for you is uh, this campaign which i know i'm sure many of you remember the the very famous old cadbury ad where the girl was uh, you know dancing on the field we call it internally in the company we call it shimona and this was uh, you know a reimagined ad from 2 years back uh, you know and one of the important tenets of generosity is inclusivity and if you see like if you were to reimagine that ad for today how would that look like this is how it would look like you can play the ad happy to see the viewership of the women's cricket go up every year and there is a cricket league also now so i think that is that's the world of today we are living in and that's the last piece i wanted to show to you and you know again uh, just uh, going back to what one started by saying purpose i think it is something which people should care about which is when it becomes powerful and the other important thing is it should be credible when you say it it should look like authentic it should look authentic and that is when you know the power of it comes together Uh, and mondley's uh, you know has been doing a lot of work around purpose you seen cadbury and generosity here uh, on some of our other brands also there is strong purpose at the heart of what everyone does uh, and that kind of shows up in you know the awards the uh, my team has been winning and mondley's india marketing uh, has won uh, is fe client of the year two times in a row now so this year and the last year defending uh, winners of the mvs you'll see how it happens this year and the company that won the most can the last couple of years so all of this has of course resulted in this fame that i just spoke about uh, but it's also resulted in uh, good business for us so going back taste yes it's important it's table stakes it's important to visually show it very powerfully but then the the real power of it is if you're able to bring a strong emotional connection with people and consumers and that's only happen when you have a strong purpose and you are able to bring it to life in an evocative way thank you